Most of the people I think that don't follow the Great One are truly stupid. I look at them and I see like little chickens running around and I don't know why but chickens pop in my mind when I see those people. I couldn't tell you how old she is. Uh, real soft face. I don't remember much about her. I was only... I was only allowed to see her once uh, until I had uh, until I had proven that I was worthy. Uh, she's good, and I'm the only good in this world. Leonard knows it in his heart. Leonard doubts nothing. Yeah, Leonard's sort of like an older brother, except he's really mean and sort of a loser. Could you take us to Dakota? Unless, unless you would, you know, freed yourself from some of the constraints of evil that, that I'm sure that, that you're bound by. She has this weird way of overcoming people's emotions and stuff. Really crazy. Bo, I see him as sort of a father figure to me. He's a good guy. And I like to stay in his, his bus, it's very comfortable there. It's pretty pitiful, man. Like, I'm just trying to bring someone here to show what we're doing, and like, you can't be selfish. Like, people want to hear this. Dakota's the only person that needs to tell her story. Well, she's not allowed to be on camera. And there's a reason for that! Well, she's not on camera. There's, there's no way that she's the gonna... The people need to learn about the Great One. Leonard doesn't believe this way. I'm gonna cry. All those other people, Bob and all them, they're dead inside. They only think they follow her. They don't, they have no idea. And Leonard, he has this weird obsession talking in third person. It's just scary. He, he never talks normal. After his mom left, he went crazy. If he heard me, he'd hate, he'd just hate me right now. Right now, I live wherever I sleep. I don't know. Every once in a while, I'll sleep at Bo's place, but for now, I just sleep next to the creek. You get fish, crickets, everything you want there. Uh, the reason we wear our masks when we go to the services is uh, mainly because we don't want to tank the air that she breathes. Um, she's, she's changed many lives. She's set a lot of people free from uh, things that bind them in their lives, things that hold them down. And uh, it's not until you meet someone like her, which I only think there is one of in the world, that you really understand the the actual state of the world. I don't want to do this anymore. Bye.
Paso.